right guys, still at the Magpul booth. I want you to check this out. So they're working with a company. Is a company called Maztec or is the product called Maztec? Uh, the company's Maztec Industries, sir. Okay, perfect. So what I got on my screen here, they got this phone that's attached to the scope. And what the scope is recording, is that round count on the left? Yes, Roger. sir. So on the bottom left here, you're going to see we've got two magazines played with our system. We're basically simulating what's in the weapon and what's on your person. So the idea is we're going to have two variants of this magazine. We have a powered and an unpowered version. So the unpowered version, when I insert into a weapon, we're going to draw power from the grip. We're going to power up, and we're going to instantly know how many rounds are present in my weapon. With the powered version of the magazine, it basically gives us an aggregate count of what's in your kit. So as soon as my magazine is paired with my system, it gives me a total count of what's on my body. So right here you'll notice it's showing five and ten. Five meaning I've got five rounds in one magazine. It's simulating being inserted in the weapon. I've got another magazine with also five rounds, meaning I've got ten rounds total. So with the screen and I go and shoot one round out, I'm now going to show four nine, meaning I've shot one, I've got nine left in my kit. I'm going to put that one back in, and I'm still going back five and ten. I pull a mag out of my kit, I drop a round accidentally, and now I'm showing I still have five in my weapon, I've got nine total. That is crazy. And you got like a uh, distance here on the right, right? Yes, Beers. sir. So on, in addition to the round counting technology here, we're also demonstrating our new fire control system. So bring any of your own LPVO that you already own. We support both 30 and 34 millimeter tubes. We've got a full ballistic solution calculator inside. We've got an environmental sensor on board. We're tracking humidity, temperature, pressure. The wind. So unfortunately, wind you can manually dial in yourself. We don't have a sensor for that currently. We also have what we're developing is a our own laser range finder. So this is a full mil spec range finder, 1550 nanometer single pulse laser. So I can tag a moving target. It's instantaneous. As soon as I get a tag, I'm automatically updating my range. I'm automatically calculating the ballistic solution for you. Is this ready, or is it still in development? So. Our system here is scheduled to be released at the end of this year. The LRF is still in development, so we don't have a release date on that yet. That is awesome. All right, thank you for that information. Of course.